for our math today. You've already watched the shape song again. That's a great song because it actually tells you all about what each shape looks like. It tells you the name and you get to draw the shape in the air with your finger. It's a good song, that one. Now, I've got a feely bag and I'm going to use some of the words that we were using yesterday to describe shapes. I'm going to use the words uh, straight, sides, corners and all the shape names. Square, triangle, rectangle and circle. Okay, so in my bag I'm going to feel a shape and I'm going to describe what it feels like when I run my finger along it. Now all these shapes are flat, that means I can hide them between my hands. If they weren't flat, uh, that, and then they'd be 2D shapes, but if they weren't flat they'd be solid and they'd be 3D shapes, but these are all 2D shapes, okay? Right, the first one I'm feeling in my bag. Ooh, this one has three straight sides. One, two, three straight sides when I feel it. It also has one, two, three pointy corners. What shape could I be describing? <gasps> Did you guess? Triangle? You were right, it is a triangle. One, two, three straight sides and one, two, three pointy corners. Clever you. Okay, let's see. This shape that I'm feeling now, it has one, two, three, four. It's got four sides. But this shape has one, two long sides and one, two, two short sides. OK, so not all the sides are the same size. Let's see, what shape would that be? And all these sides are straight as well. They're not round. It's a rectangle. Well done rectangle two long sides two short sides okay oh this one also one two three four also has four straight sides and it has one two three four corners which shape has four straight sides and they're all the same size it's a square. <gasps> Did you say square? Well done, a square. Okay. Oh, last one. Ooh, this one has got one side that goes all the way around. So it's not got straight sides. Not straight sides or pointy corners. No, this one. It's round side, a side that goes all the way around. Oh, what could that be called? <laughs> it's a circle. There is a circle. So we've had circle, square, rectangle and triangle. Now what I want you to do now is to go outside with your grown-ups and have a look all around you at all the buildings and see what shapes you can see on them. It might be that you see a house that's got a pointy roof like a triangle shape. It might be that you see a bus that has some wheels and they look round. It might be that you see on a house a front door that looks like this shape. It might even be that you see a window in a house that's a round shape. Some, some houses have lovely round windows. I'd love a round window in my house. <laughs> right, so 
go and have a look outside. If it's that you can't go out, have a look around your house. See what you can find that are all these different shapes. You're going on a shape hunt. Off you go. Go and find all different shapes around your house and maybe collect some or outside and then send me a picture of all the things you found you might even draw some pictures of all the different shapes that you found that would be nice and don't forget to send me them when you've had a go and I want to hear that you've been using all those words that I've just said have a go <laughs>